So today I'm going to tell us about KA21 beta glucan. And uh, this mushroom is agaric blase, KA21. So <laughs> this is today's topic. Next slide. So today, first, I'm going to introduce about my company, Toei Shinyak Co. Limited. And next, so going to introduce about agaric braseensis, blase, and cyberfessence, the medicinal mushroom, and our own King Agaric K21. The first one is our evidence about K21, about and the five, five uh, we introduce about our products, K21 beta glucan. So let's move to first topic about Toei Shinyak Co. Limited, our company. So our company is uh, established by my father. He established my company in 1973. The, uh, at that time, he sold sanitary dates goes. And 1996, when the agaric mushroom came to Brazil, into Japan, he started to sell and handle King Agalics. So she's, uh, this is uh, our customer's feedback video. The, the old lady is actually my father, uh, my mother. She got a cancer at that time when my father started to handle our King Agalics. Then after, uh, 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 sorry. Mm -hmm. So when my father started to uh, meet our King Agalix, uh, just the same time my mother got a cancer. Then my father tried to use King Agalix to my mother. She, at that time, she got a uh, gastric cancer. Then she used only, she only took King Agalix as uh, tea. And then the cancer has disappeared. So, my father had strong, at that time, my father, the founder of our comp company, uh, had the strong confidence that King Akalix is real one. Then he started to uh, join research with university. Why King Akalix is so good? Why it works really pretty well? So he started to research at uh, Tokyo University of Pharmacy and Life Sciences where my father graduated. And also he started, uh, after that, he started uh, co-research uh, co with uh, Animal, uh, Azab University of Veterinary Medicine and the other uh, many universities. Then 2000, uh, he ran, uh, our company launched King Agalix 100. Left side is granule and rice at his tablet. We sold this product as immunobooster for cancer patient. Then the next slide. So then uh, first we only sell our King Agalix 100 that as human supplement, but my customer, or many customer they, who has uh, pets, their pets got uh, some cancer. So many uh, customers asked us, uh, can we use the King Agalix 100 for pets? So we get many customers' voice about the pet owner. Then we started to sell 2015 King Agalix 100. It's the same as KA21 beta glucan on the internet. This one is uh, this product. We sell this uh, product in Japan. And this product is uh, actually totally same as the King Agalix 100 for human products. We just changed the out pack, outer package. The inside is the same. Then after uh, three years ago, uh, we, uh, we started to sell at this product to, uh, at the vet clinics. After we made a conference presentation at Japan Veterinary Cancer Society. So, and as, as a product 2020, we won the Nutra Ingredients Award as human products, product of the uh, product of the year, botanical. So, this uh, so far we have published thirty-two pay academic papers as number one agalix blase research company. 
So now we publish 32 academic papers. Um, the other is 18 and seven and four. So we, we are the number one agarics research company now. And we have the most evidence uh, other than other company. So next topic is uh, what is agarics brasiliensis? And um, introduce about King Agarics K21. First, Agarics brasiliensis. Uh, Agarics brasiliensis is a medicinal mushroom originally grown in Brazil. The academic name is Agalix Blase. We, uh, 10 years ago, we only used Agalix Blase, but after some research, uh, the academic name changed to Agalix Brasiliensis or Agalix Subrufescence. So now at the uh, academic conference, Agalix Brasiliensis or Agalix Subrufescence, a uh, common name as academic name. And this mushroom is known as mushroom of sun in Brazil because uh, if the mushroom originally had strong energy, they can uh, they can grow under the sunshine. And also the mushroom called mushroom of God, uh, according to this uh, great efficacy. Our main components of Agalix brasiliensis is a beta glucan. 1, 3, and 1, 6. And it contains rich minerals, iron, potassium, and magnesium, zinc, copper, and many minerals. Also, it contains rich vitamins, vitamin B1, B2, B6, niacin, and the other vitamins. So agarix is the most popular immune booster in Japan. So about 2002 or three, uh, 26 per cancer patients in Japan took agarix as immune booster in Japan. This data is published by uh, Japan's uh, government, Ministry of Health. And then at that time, agarix is uh, many cancer patients select agarix as immune booster. Six, more than 60% cancer patients select Agalix as immune booster. So in Japan, this mushroom is very popular, especially for cancer patients. Um, but uh, this mushroom, the components and the efficacy and safety are quite different, depends on the strain and the method of cultivation and processing and origin and part of mushroom. So I'm going to uh, please see the next pictures here. So these two mushrooms, they are both of them are agarix. But the difference is the cultivation method. The left side is outdoor and the right side is indoor. So if we change the cultivation method, the appearance are totally different. So we can say almost other mushroom. So I'm going to introduce about the cultivation method and origin about the agarix. So nowadays, uh, these days we cannot get uh, not we cannot harvest the uh, natural agarix. It's really hard to cultivate. Uh, it's really hard to harvest. So the most nearest to the nature one is outdoor cultivation agarix. So many company, uh, outdoor one contains the rich minerals and vitamins and efficacy is very strong. Uh, many company try to cultivate outdoor, but the most of company uh, cannot cultivate outdoor. To cultivate, to cultivate outdoor, we need three components. One is environment in Brazil, nature to Brazil, uh, origin of uh, Galix. And the second is special compost, rich uh, minerals and vitamins on special compost. And the third one is strong strain. Uh, we use King Agalix 21, the uh, KA21 strain. And this strain is very strong, which can grow under the strong sunshine. And normally the other mushroom is indoor. Indoor agarix uh, cultivated in Brazil, Japan, China, and the USA, 
and etc. other countries. So it's uh, outdoor is very hard, but indoor is not so. Uh, indoor cultivation is very easy. So the cultivation method indoor is spread widely. On the right side is the uh, tank culture. Tank culture, uh, the mushroom has two parts, separate two parts. One is fruit body, the where we can eat, we can have. And uh, the other part is mycelium. It's a kind of here, we cannot have, we cannot eat. So tank culture is cultivate mycelium in tank in tank. So this tank culture is uh, maybe only used in Japan. Uh, about the 2002, agarics is very, uh, after agarics became very popular, many companies tried to make agarics and the tank culture is the easiest one. We just need a tank and cultivate the mycelium. The cheap and we don't need any area. So at that time, the tank culture is spread, but this day, tank culture mycelium doesn't have safety and efficacy data. So mainly, uh, I got other mainly the main cultivation method is indoor now. So I'm going to introduce the difference between outdoor and indoor. The first, the method of cultivation in indoor cultivation method. So many many people hear the name of indoor. Many people imagine that kind of the house, greenhouse. But actually, the indoor cultivation is agarics indoor cultivation is an um, avoid the sunshine like this um, dark area, humid and dark and yeah, this kind of artificial area. So indoor agarics cannot grow as same as original agarics the size. The size is very small and the uh, minerals and vitamins components are very low. So uh, so going to introduce about outdoor next. So this is an outdoor field. So this is the compost and the mushroom is grown directly from the land. So I took the video I'm going to introduce about here. Oh, 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 oh sorry. Sorry, big noise. <laughs> uh, Oh, is the sound is very big. So can we use it? So the mushroom is a the agalex is a goat and the directly from the land. I harvest. It's easy to harvest. The size is about 15 centimeters. Uh, the Picture of the gloves. It's a size of like five, uh, two or three centimeters. You hear the mushrooms bigger and bigger. Oh. Sorry, like this. So uh, I, I wanted to show the video, but yeah, it's difficult. So I'm going to introduce it by my uh, word. So this is uh, our, our, uh, our farm's environment. Uh, our farm is in Brazil and there is no factory around the farm. Uh, only wild nature in the here. The air is very clean and the water is also clean. So 
and also we uh, we cultivate only one time. We change the area uh, every time, and we cultivate without any pesticides. Concerning about the safety of the mushroom. Then the size is here. Left size is outdoor, and right size is indoor. The size is totally different. So this picture is 2002. Uh, last year, last February, uh, sorry, last year when I went to the Brazil, so I took this picture. Each mushroom is uh, almost the same as my face. It's very big, big and huge. And the components is here. So the main components of agarix is beta glucan. It contains uh, 1.5 times more than other agarix, um, indoor cultivation agarix. Also, our king agarix contains rich vitamin D because it's cultivated under sunshine. Also about the minerals, this is comparing with Japanese greenhouse agarix. In the Brazil, the soil is very red. It contains a lot of minerals like islands and copper. And also we cultivate only one time. So uh, we cultivate only one time to harvest the rich, um, rich minerals and vitamins uh, contains one. And comparing this Japanese one, calcium is 26 times more than Japanese one. And also the rich copper and iron and serenium and vitamin B1. Also the effect, so antioxidative activity is also different. The rest that is King Agalix outdoor cultivation one. And here is uh, King Door indoor. We just try to make it in the indoor to experiment comparing the cultivation method. And the right side is Japanese indoor. So comparing with uh, normal Japanese uh, indoor Agalix, the antioxidative activity is five times stronger than agarics in indoor in Japan. So far, uh, I introduced about the king, uh, the difference between out cultivation method, outdoor and indoor and tank culture. So we use our uh, our king agarics is outdoor cultivation in Brazil. And the strain is KA21. So from now, we, uh, I want to move to the evidence of KA21. So first, we, uh, I want to introduce about the safety data. We do several tests in the mice and the human trial. First, uh, the mice tests, uh, we checked the mutagenicity and the genotoxicity is very safe. We confirmed the safety of this kind of subject. Also, we did a human trial, uh, the normal dosage for three months and six months. Also the overdose about uh, three times of normal dosage on six months. We confirmed the safety in human trial. So here is the evidence about the effect. So mainly agarix is used for as an immune booster. So many people focus on only on improved immunity, but we uh, for 32 academic papers, we confirm this kind of uh, evidence. So today I, I want to introduce you about the, this red one, improved immunity, antifungal infection, like malasitia and anti-stress and uh, stop the hair loss and gray hair, improve the fur condition in the pets, and quick recovery after injury and the surgery. And the last one is live longer, life extension and keep motor functions. First, I want to introduce about uh, improved immunity and antifungal infection. About, uh, I want to introduce about these data. Before showing the evid our evidence, I want to introduce how King Agarix improved the immunity. So this uh, mechanism is uh, supervised by our professor, Naohito Ono. So mushroom is vegetable. Of course, no, it's a fungi. Agarix is, uh, ag including uh, mushroom, including agarix, 
is the uh, uh, same as uh, candida and mold. It's same uh, fungi. The mycelium is um, the fruit body doesn't look like same as the candida, but mycelium is it's almost same as mold and candida. And the beta glucan is the cell walls of fungi. Contains uh, of uh, mushroom and uh, candida like fungi. The left side is agalix, uh, the structure of beta glucan of agalix blase, uh, beta one three and one six. And the middle one, center one, is the other uh, mushroom, Spalacis crisper. It contains a lot of uh, one three and the small one six. So if we uh, the kind of mushroom changed, the structure of beta glucan also changed. And please see the right side. It's a candida albicans. It's a pathogen of fungi. It causes some disease. And please compare with the agalix and candida. The structures are almost very similar and almost the same. The similarity is very important. Next slide is on. Um, what happened after we take beta glucan? So main minerals and um, minerals and vitamins are absorbed at the intestine, but the beta glucan is not absorbed uh, in the stomach and the intestine. It goes to intestine. The many of the immune cell is in, uh, in intestine. In the intestine, um, when immune cell find beta glucan in the intestine, the immune cell cannot tell it's a galix or candida. So immune cell, after immune cell, when immune cell catch beta glucan, the immune cell consider it the pathogen is invaded into the body. I mean, uh, uh, the structure of beta glucan between agalix and candida are very similar. So immune cell cannot tell it's a good or not. So many times uh, cancer uh, immune cell consider it's a pathogen. So the, we, the immune cell need to be attacked and fight against the pathogen to protect the body. So first, innate immunity is stimulated, including natural killer cell. Natural killer cells is um, against, fight against with cancer and also other pathogens, a virus and other, yeah, some kind of um, viruses, yeah. And that's why it called, uh, Galix has the, the evidence about the anti-cancer and prevention infection, prevent infection. And after innate immunity, Acquired immunity are uh, also uh, stimulated. And anti beta glucan antibody is made by uh, B cell. And the antibody beta glucan is uh, worked against the agalix. Also, this antibody is re reaction both agalix and beta glucan with pathogenic fungi like Candida, Malassezia, and other uh, pathogenic fungi because the structure is almost same. So the mechanism of uh, beta-glucan, uh, why beta-glucan improve the immunity? So beta-glucan is not absorbed, absorbed a little bit, but main mechanism is uh, stimulate immune cells in the intestine. So going to, uh, again, I introduced about as uh, academic one, so immune cells like ma macrophage and dendritic cells, it has the receptor dictin one, and dictin one contains uh, dictin one uh, catch to the beta one point three glucan. So in, after dendritic cells, beta, uh, dictin one uh, catch the one point three beta glucan. So immune cells uh, made interleukin and some like in, uh, interferon gamma to stimulate other immune cells. So this is our evidence in the human trial. We confirmed whether our King Agalix can improve immunity or not in human trial. 
this one is a human trial. Uh, we uh, human volunteers took three gram a day for seven days. Left side is uh, the group who took the agarics. The net activity of natural killer cells is increased, and statistically, it there, there is a big difference. And right side is placebo. Now we can see the difference between here. So we confirmed uh, King Agalix, uh, taking King Agalix can improve the natural killer cell activity, uh, which against uh, which fight against the cancer and other virus and pathogens. And um, also we do the test uh, in the mice test. We put the glaucoma into the mice. It's a kind of cancer. We put the cancer into the mice and give them give the mice the agalix extract. And we confirmed the anti-tumor effect in like this mice test. The normal the tumor size is 15 grams. The group who took the agalix uh, hot water extract, the size is uh, shrinked 47%. And here is the, the other evidence about the antifungal infection. So after uh, in the left side, uh, we this is a human uh, human trial. Uh, the volunteer, human volunteer took the three gram a day per all of for three months. After that, we checked the anti uh, beta group antibody, and IgG and A. These types of uh, antibody is increased, especially IgA. It uh, it related the uh, mucosal immunity. So statistically, it increased. On the right side, it's uh, less dosage. Left side is three a day, and right side is 900 milligram a day. Uh, so per all other human volunteer took 900 milligram a day for six weeks and two, 12 weeks. It, we also confirmed the increase of the anti-beta glucan antibody. Uh, according to this uh, data, we can say, uh, King, uh, con according to the, this data, uh, we can consider King Agalix can uh, has the evidence to prevent the antifungal infection, like uh, in the ducts, like malassezia. And after uh, after that the human uh, human trial, now this one is the uh, newest data in the ducts and the cats. It's a clinical data about on the antifungal infection dogs and cats. The method of inter internet uh, clinical trial. Uh, the number is um, total number is ninety seven, and the midterm data is fifty six. So we put one uh, three hundred milligram of King Agalix one tablet a day for the dogs or cats, uh, the weight is uh, five to six kilograms. The dosage is almost, uh, the dosage is same as the commercial product of uh, KA21 beta glucan. And we, uh, we checked the satisfaction of veterinary doctors and we checked the general health activity, food consumption, and also symptoms of the fungal infection. But this one is uh, general health. The number is 50, uh, 56. The satisfaction of vet doctors is very satisfied is 13 and satisfied 33. So more than satisfied is 82% for, uh, for using the Kinga Galax to the antifungal uh, fungal infection. The rest side and um, about the general health activity is improved and down is good and increase is bad. So activity is uh, improved statistically and also food consumption is uh, improved, improved statistically. And here is uh, malassezia dermatitis. The number is uh, 20, dogs 14 and cats at six. And more than satisfied 85% by vet doctors. And each Symptoms, each redness, dandruff, 
always skin and follows all the subjects uh, improved statistically. Also, Malasetia external otitis and the, on, on the year, in, in the year. Uh, more than satisfies more than, uh, 81.8%. The number is 22, dogs is 21, and cats are one. All of these symptoms, each redness, earwax, and the smell and follows improved statistically. And the next one is dermatophytosis. And the number is 14, dogs is two, cats are 12. More than satisfied is 78.5%. So all the symptoms are improved and statistically improved on each and redness and far loss. Uh, so far, uh, I introduced about uh, Im improved immunity and antifungal infection. So according to this kind of academic data, um, new data, so we can recommend our K21 beta glucan to improve immunity against anti-infection anti and anti-cancer. Also antifungal infection, including malasetia and dermatophytosis. And next one is to reduce the side effect of anti-cancer drugs. The effect of uh, uh, reduce the side effect of chemotherapy. So I made the oral conference, uh, oral presentation at the international conference. Uh, here is International Medicinal Mushroom Conference Tense. So the presenter is me. So I'm going to discuss about this data. The background of uh, why we do we did this research? The background is here. We have uh, we had uh, old data again about the uh, cyclophosphamido bone marrow suppression leukopenia. We do uh, we had this kind of data, but the data is very old, and we haven't published this data. So we wanted to confirm the effect anti-cancer drug. So we do the test again. The subject is 5-FU. This uh, medicine, uh, anti-cancer drug, is uh, widely used for colon cancer in human. And the main side effect is bone marrow suppression and appetite loss, nausea, vomiting, and kid kidney damage. Uh, this one is the uh, the test model. We use, we use the rat, uh, mice, and we 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 gave the mice uh, four types of uh, feed. One is healthy control without any anti-cancer drug and normal food. And the second one is five FU anti-cancer drug with no agarics. K twenty one O D outdoor is five uh, FU and outdoor agarics, and also we comparing uh, to compare the effect uh, of cultivation method. So we used the K twenty one indoor one also. Then after we change the food into four groups, we gave the mice five FU for five days and check the side effect, four days, 12 days, and 90 days. The result is here. First, uh, survival rate. The, this one, the, uh, the uh, oh, sorry. K21 OD is here. The total survival rate is about 60%. So 30 is death by, anti-cancer drug. And without uh, the AI and this group is control, which doesn't, didn't take any agarics, the mortality risk is just survival rate is only 30%. So it means uh, this group, which did not take any agarics, 90% are died by anti-cancer drug. And indoor, the mortality list is the same as uh, outdoor one, 70%. Survival rate is the same. And next, the protective effect on the digestive tract. 
when our digestive tract get a damage by anti-cancer drug, the length of intestine is getting shorter. So the length of intestine, uh, the control is uh, shorter than our king agarics, outdoor one. It's statistically different between outdoor, between outdoor and control, also outdoor and indoor. Also the, in the colon, the length of colon, it's also different. The, the length of uh, colon is also statistically different between outdoor and control, also outdoor and indoor. And it uh, incidence and the percentage of diarrhea. More than 70% control group get a diarrhea. But the outdoor one, uh, the percentage of diarrhea is uh, just 25%. So, uh, uh, and also here is appetite recovery. And the rest side is control, a healthy one. Uh, this group did not get any anti-cancer drug. And the right side is uh, anti-cancer drug group. The light, light one is uh, K21 outdoor. So after we uh, after the mice took five FU, the appetite is uh, weaker, uh, decreased, but the outdoor keeps the appetite comparing with the control on the indoor one. It uh, uh, considering about the, uh, why uh, they still, uh, also, sorry, next one is the weight, total body weight. After injection, after taking the anti-cancer drug, all the groups, the body weight of all the groups uh, decreased, but the agarix group, K21 group, increased uh, recovery quickly, almost same as healthy one. So why uh, it, uh, I th I, we, we think, um, the protection effect of uh, intestine is uh, related to this weight loss and appetite and diarrhea. And here is kidney injury. Here is kidney damage. And control on in, in indoor has a big damage on the kidney. But the outdoor group is uh, no statistical difference between healthy and outdoor one. So when, once we get a kidney damage by anti-cancer drug, we, cannot, uh, we don't have any medicine to treat the kidney cancer, kidney damage. So it's very uh, important to prevention for the kidney damage by anti-cancer drug. And the next one is recovery from leukopenia. This one is a healthy control. And uh, all these three groups which took uh, anti-cancer drug the white blood cell decreased like this. But after several days, King Agalis group uh, recovery quickly. So during the anti-cancer therapy, uh, when the cancer's uh, blood cell is still low, we cannot do the next uh, regime. We cannot keep the anti-cancer drug treatment. So it's very important about it's very important to keep the anti-cancer drug medicine treatment. So it's very important about the recovery from the leukopenia. And also here is the far condition. Left side is uh, control. Uh, it, it means uh, took 5-FU without agarix. And center middle one is indoor one. And right side is control. Uh, you can see the difference between the outdoor and indoor uh, control. Outdoor one keeps the far condition, uh, even though they took the five FU. So we also made the side effect model mice. So we uh, shaved the body uh, when we start to give the mice the five FU. So recovery is here. Once we shape the mice body, uh, when we start to get the start to anti-cancer drug uh, therapy, uh, King Agalis group uh, recovery quickly, more than the 5 FU group, and also in, in Dua 1. It means uh, 
once the mice, uh, also once dogs or cats uh, got a hair loss by anti-cancer drug, uh, if they took the, they take King Agalix, the fur condition recover quickly uh, other than, uh, than without taking any Agalix. A conclusion is here. Left side control, indoor and right one, uh, outdoor. Outdoor has a strong uh, evidence and strong effect about the uh, uh, prevention for leukopenia, appetite recovery, body weight, kidney damage, and protect digestive tract and health recovery. Uh, what is the difference between indoor and outdoor? What causes the difference? So we focus on the antioxidative activities. Uh, this one is agalix outdoor and indoor. And we check the other many mushrooms here. Lentin uh, it's a itolingi, gulicona fondosa. So agalix outdoor has a strong antioxidant activities. So the difference between the outdoor and indoor, it causes the difference between the effect of here. Here, so King Agalix uh, outdoor cultivation in Brazil has a strong, uh, already showed the effect about the anti-cancer activity and the immune activation. Also, in this study, we confirmed the reduced side effects chemotherapy. So King Agalix K21 can support the cancer therapy um, widely, not only against the cancer by improved immunity, also, uh, support the cancer patient by reducing the side effects of chemotherapy here. And we did a test about the uh, effect of side, uh, reduced side effects of chemotherapy by veterinary doctors. We get a uh, customer feedback from the vet doctors. They, the vet doctors uh, gave their dogs and cats during the chemotherapy they are uh, their satisfaction uh, and also so their satisfaction is more than their satisfaction uh, more than satisfaction the answer is 92% 0.2% so it's uh, the effect is also showed in the uh, by bed doctors not only the mice test so far, uh, I introduced about the uh, improved immunity and antifungal infection. Next is anti-anti-stress. Anti oh, sorry, different one. So uh, we did the test uh, against. Uh, so we did a rat. Uh, sorry, uh, to confirm the anti-stress and adjusting out autonomic nerve systems, we did a test uh, the hypertensive rat. Hypertensive rat is all the time they are excited. So the aut uh, autonomic nerve system of hypertensive rat is uh, not uncontrolled. They are all the time they are excited. So the blood pressure and heart rate is very high. The blue point is um, normal hypertensive rat. The heartbeat and blood pressure is increasing um, every time. Um, we checked the effect of anti-stress and adjusting out nervous systems, uh, whether taking agalix uh, makes the excited rat to relax or not. So uh, taking agalix um, is um, reduce the main blood pressure so like this, that it, uh, this one is a red one. Uh, the blood pressure is statistically decreased. Also the heart rate, uh, the blue one is all, all the time they're excited, but we, but the rat which took the agalix, uh, the heart rate is uh, become calm down and relax. According to this study, so we recommend, uh, according to this study, uh, considering the mechanism, why it, uh, and, uh, it has um, calmed down the excited rat, uh, we think um, agalix has the 
adjusting the effect of adjusting out nervous system, including anti-stress. So according to this study, we, <coughs> sorry, please wait a moment. <coughs> So according to that last study, so these kind of uh, symptoms uh, related to the stress, like the dog, they lick the fingers and skins uh, until destroy their skin and uh, between the fingers. Also less appetite and diarrhea, angry problem behavior and bark every time. These kind of symptoms are related to the stress or uh, 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 yeah, uh, related to the stress. So uh, many vet doctors and also the pet uh, pet owners uh, use our King Agalex uh, against this kind of uh, symptoms and get many good uh, customer feedbacks, especially for the lick the fingers and the skins. Many dogs uh, rigs uh, between the fingers and the skins are destroyed. But after taking the Kinga Galix, many uh, we have the many many customers good feedback about this uh, uh, find, find the uh, problem behavior. They stop the reading and the skin conditions getting better. Also, yeah, less appetite is uh, improving. So next topic is uh, stop the hair loss and improve the gray hair and input the fur condition in the mice test. Uh, first, uh, I want to introduce about the fur loss model and the hair gloss effect in the mice, mice test. Uh, here is the three types of mice, gray one, white one, and black one. We, we gave these mice uh, three types of the feed. One is control, which doesn't contain any agalics. And uh, this one is indoor. 3% of agalix and outdoor one. We gave three types of mice, uh, three types of uh, food. After we changed the food, we shaved the uh, skin on the, their body and we evaluate whether the hair regrows or not. The result is here. The gray hair is very short. We put, I put the circle. The control is uh, the upper side, and indoor is middle one, and outdoor is uh, the bottom one. You can see the difference between the outdoor, indoor, and the control. Also, here is a uh, black one and white one. Outdoor has stronger effect, uh, hair gloss effect, uh, more than indoor and the control. Here's the result. Gray hair and black hair and white hair and control indoor, outdoor. So outdoor, all the group, outdoor has a strong effect than indoor and control. So we check the whether it uh, Agalix has a uh, hair gloss effect or not. So we show the hair gloss uh, improvement, the next test. So we also change, uh, shape their body and we put the hair growth score. Um, method is uh, no change plus weak growth, uh, weak effect, mild hair, strong hair, like here. We put like this point, three days, seven days, 10 days, number one, number two, number three, like this. Then the gray hair one, gray hair is the short, uh, the hair is very short, so we cannot see any change about the outdoor, indoor, and control. But the longer hair, white hair here. So we, uh, the hair gloss score is uh, statistically different between outdoor and control in the 10 days. Also the black hair here. It's also statistically different between outdoor and against to the indoor and control one. So we can see the strong effect on outdoor is stronger hair gloss effect than indoor and control. Here is the mice test, and the next is the human trial. 
uh, we did the human trial uh, for <clears throat> 22 people and took 900 milligram a day or high dose, uh, 1,000, 1. 1.5 gram a day. And we put uh, low dosage group is number is 20, uh, 12, and high dosage group is 10. And the result is here. So we can see the statistically different at uh, improving the hair loss and improve the gray hair. Also, we can see the sensitive of the cold, reduce the fatigue, easy to wake up, show the stiffness, and awake the, during the day, and eye strain. So according to this improving the hair loss and improve the gray hair, it's related to the dogs and cats. The Falcon, um, we have the many customer feedback. After they took the agarics, they feel the improvement of the far condition and the skin condition. It's related to uh, this data. So far, so improve the far condition. According to the data related to the improving the far condition, we recommend to hear uh, dogs and cats, and also senior dogs, uh, see the dogs and cats with the fun condition is uh, getting worse by uh, age. And next is a uh, quick recovery after injury and surgery. This is a st study design. Uh, we did a mice test and also the same as the fat condition. We make a three group. We divide a three group, control, house, and outdoor. And after we change the food, uh, after one week, uh, after we change the food one week, we remove their shave the hair and re remove the skin by biopsy too, and then we check the size of uh, scar wood, and also we check the some collagen and yeah some interleukin like this. The result is here. So wound after 12 days. The control, the size is wound is different. The control is here and indoor. You can see the difference be uh, between the outdoor and indoor and control. Very small wound. Statistically, it's also different. The back one is an uh, outdoor. The outdoor is statistically different between uh, indoor and uh, out a uh, control. According to this data, we can say K King Agalix uh, outdoor improves the wound healing. So it means uh, after the dogs and cats get an injury or after surgery, uh, we can expect the quick re recovery effect. And also we check why uh, Agalix can improve the Agalix. Uh, make quicker uh, wood healing. So <laughs> this one is collagen one, type one, and TZF better, and collagen three, and interleukin one alpha. Um, collagen one and TZF better, and collagen type three are related to the wood healing. So we can see the statistical different about the collagen three. So to Wound feeling, uh, it's a mechanism uh, of uh, uh, why uh, King Agalic group uh, has a quick recovery effect. Uh, collagen type three is uh, related to this effect. And the right, bottom of the right side is interleukin one alpha. It's related to inflammation. So it does not cause uh, any inflammation after the surgery. We can see from this data. And quick wound healing by promoting type 3 collagen is confirmed. And here is the feedback from veterinary doctors after surgery. We get uh, more than 88.7% 80, uh, get a more than satisfied and very high satisfaction rate. Um, number is 53. So from this data, we recommend strongly recommend after surgery or during the surgery, uh, before the surgery and after the surgery or injury, quick recovery from the, this uh, surgery and in injury. 
the last data is live longer and keep motor function. This one is the newest, newest data related longevity. Average like extension and keep motor function and improve the microbiome is the newest data. Here is life extension. Uh, we used uh, uh, the, it's a fry test, fries like this, small one. The lifespan is very small, very short. It's uh, may, uh, many times we use uh, this fries to check the life extension test. So the red one is um, a galax outdoor group. And black and blue, black is control and blue is uh, indoor. So we can see the, the group who took outdoor group, the average life, uh, life extension, we can see the longer life, uh, longer lives, yeah, from this data. Also, fries, fries, like upper side, their uh, habits like this. And if the fries uh, get old, they cannot fry here. The, their motor functions reduce and they cannot fry anymore after they get old. So the percentage is here, we see the percentage of climbing. And after the, uh, the fries get old, the percentage is reduced because they, their motor function is uh, reduced. They cannot fry climbing. So the right side is uh, outdoor group. Uh, taking agalix, uh, taking outdoor agalix, they keep the motor function by aging. And next data is uh, mice, mice test. Um, after we gave the mice king agalix and or control, so we checked the micro uh, changing of the microbiome. After seven days and 12, uh, 28 days, we see the, uh, this uh, kind of microbiome is increased. And check the, what is this uh, microbiome? This one is Acamansia muscifinula. And Acamansia muscifinula is uh, many in centenarian. I mean, more than 100 years old people has this kind of uh, microbiome in their guts. Also, uh, skinny people has this uh, microbiome in their guts. And this uh, Akamansa muscipinula has anti-obesity and anti-diabetes effect. So uh, considering this effect, uh, we expect uh, diabetes or uh, obesity dogs and cats uh, keep their health like this. So far, I introduced about evidence of K21. So next is uh, about the product. I want to introduce about the product. So K21 beta glucan. So what is K21? K21 is a toys, our own strain name of Agalix brasiliensis. Uh, this strain has strong vitality and can use for outdoor cultivation. And this, um, this strain is registered at uh, Japanese Patent Organism Depos Depository in Japan as King Agalix 21, KA21. Here's a paper. King, we registered King Agalix K21. Shorten, we say KA21. And we have published many papers as Agalix Brasiliensis K21, like this to improve immunity about, this paper is related to improve immunity, Agalix Brasiliensis K21 and antifungal infection, Agalix Brasiliensis K21. And this K21 is registered as trademark in EU. EU. Here, K21 is registered. Thank you very much. <laughs> and it's a history about this, uh, this product. The first in Japan, we launched as King Agalix 100 for cancer patient in Japan, like this granule and tablet type. And 2015, we launched King Agalix 100 for pets. This one is totally same as K21 beta glucan. Also totally same as King Agalix 100 for human. Just we changed the package. 
the inside PDB and the tablet are totally same as human. And King Agarlic's product is won the uh, award, uh, Neutral Ingredient Award, product of the year botanical 2020, last year. Uh, we, uh, according to this, uh, why we get, uh, why we won the, this award, yeah, uh, the many people evaluate our strong evidence and uh, popularity in Japan and good sales in Japan also. This is why we get the award. And market information here, we sell this, uh, we export our King of Galaxy product to 16 countries and now preparing for three countries now. And sales at vet clinics increased. Uh, we started in 2018. So the vet sales at vet clinics in Japan increased 183% from 2019 to 220. And this year uh, estimated one, about roughly 150% uh, comparing with last year. So uh, even though this uh, coronavirus situation, the sales increase very good, I think. And here is product information. Ingredients is uh, Agalix Brazil NCSK21, uh, cultivated outdoor in Brazil. Uh, we did not any additives. It's 100% made from Agalix. And Three uh, hundred uh, milligrams, thirty tablets in one aluminum pack. As a product, we uh, K twenty one is one pack or two packs. And main components beta glucan. And manufactured as uh, originally, yeah, as human supplement at GMP supplement factory in Japan. And sold now, uh, this, this product is sold as human supplement in Japan and USA. And here is a GMP factory in Japan. Uh, we, uh, this pro it's me. Uh, this product is uh, manufactured under strict, uh, strict control uh, situation. They check the, some, some bad things or not like this. And here is dosage. Um, so why we decided the dosage 300 milligram a day per five to six gram of body weight. So it's based on human trial, which is uh, improved natural care cell activity, three gram a day. So human is, uh, including Japanese, um, human is uh, like 50 to 60 kilogram, maybe 70 kilograms. So uh, this uh, three gram a day is for 50 to 60 kilogram for human. So maybe pets is, Fifth, five to six gram equal um, 300 milligrams. It's uh, same dosage, yeah. This is why we decided the uh, dosage 300 milligrams a day according to this yeah, evidence about this. Here is the dosage. Less than five kilograms is the half size. Uh, five to 10, yeah, it's easy to understand five and 10 like this. <laughs> So five to 10, one tablet, two tablets from for 10 to 15, 15 to 23, yeah, four, and uh, more than 25 is added one extra tablet per five kilograms. So your question, 70 kilogram is a 14 tablets, but maybe 10 tablets is good enough. And how to feed? And um, so I want to introduce uh, it's very, uh, we do not any additives. So it's easy to cut. So if you gave the small dog or cats, uh, like this half size, please cut over the PTP seat. It's easy to cut. Also how to feed, um, give them directly, or put in into the cheese and put in the dry food or um, also, we did not put any additives, so it's, it's easy to crush and mix into the food, like food. And also we recommend into the yogurt. It's good for the bowel system, intestine. And main use for yeah, improve immunity and uh, 
prevention antifungal infection. Yeah, reduce the side effects of chemotherapy, like lick fingers and skins, less appetite and diarrhea, and improve the far condition. Uh, we are going to do the trial from this year about the far condition in the senior dog and cats. And after surgery and after injury for senior to keep their health. From here is a question and answer. The side effects in human, uh, there are some people who have a mushroom allergy. So we do not recommend them to take King Agalix because it contains agaric mushroom. But about the dogs and cats, it's really difficult to see it. And in human, it contains rich dietary fiber. Some people feel the digestive symptoms when they started to take it because of rich dietary fiber. It's good for constipation, but uh, some people feel like uh, digestive symptom. If they feel this kind of um, digestive symptoms, please reduce the dosage and the half for maybe one or two weeks to accustom to the rich dietary fiber and recover, remove, uh, recover to the same normal dosage. And other agalics made in China and extra, uh, extract products has, uh, there is some re report about that, uh, not our product, but agalic brazi made in China and extra product about the liver dysfunction. But King Agalex has a liver protection effect. We don't need to care about this kind of liver protection, dysfunction. Here is the data. Um, we put the mice, uh, carbon tetracycle, and then cause the uh, liver damage. But uh, KAOD is here. If we put the KAOD, we protect the liver. This one is 3%. If we put the, uh, increase the 10%, we totally stopped the river uh, inflammation. So other agalics made in China and maybe extra product cause river function, uh, river damage, but our king agalics has a strong evidence to protect the river protection. And here is interaction with medicine and other supplement. It's not our data, but uh, for your information, the agalics inhibited CYP3A4 metabolism in just in vitro. Um, in clinically, uh, the relevant systemic, uh, systemic and intestinal interaction with CYP3A4 were considering unlikely. So you don't need to care about, you can use agaric with medicine and other mushroom. There's no interaction. According to this, uh, you don't need to worry about interaction about the agalics, according to this essay. And how long should we feed? Also, it, it depends on dogs and cats. Uh, keeping taking is a dosage and stop taking. And for example, if the after the injury, uh, many dogs and cats after recover from the injury, Maybe they don't need to take keeping uh, agalics, but for keep the good health and against prevention for the cancer or antifungal infection, we recommend to keep taking ag King Agalics products. It depends on page, uh, situation of dogs and cats. Uh, should it be taken in the morning or night? Yeah, con uh, considering about the uh, absorbed nutrition, not, not the beta glucan, uh, uh, we think at night is better because at night uh, absorption uh, ability is uh, stronger than daytime. And if the dosage is larger, should it be spread throughout the day? We don't have any data about this, date, uh, this uh, question. But spread, uh, considering, uh, according to uh, doctors in human trial, the doctors told us uh, spread several times is better because uh, many chance to stimulate immune cells is better, but we, we don't have data.
Uh, should it be given by food or separately? It de depends on the preference of each dog and cat. If they have the food directly, we can put uh, we can put into the food. But yeah, it depends on dogs uh, preference of each dog and cats. Mm, yeah, the big big size. <laughs> I have I have never had seventy kilograms in Japan, <laughs> but yeah, uh, maybe you can put uh, the dosage is fourteen tablets, uh, but uh, according to human data, yeah, the ten tablets is maybe enough, and it costs very it costs very expensive. So <laughs> ten tablets is maybe enough, and it. Depends on the dog's preference. If they have with the food, you can put the tablets into the food. But if they don't, they don't want. He didn't. He doesn't want to have in the food. Maybe granulate and mix into the food is better. And maybe veterinary doctors are curious about other animals. So. We don't have clinical data, but we have the data. Many like horse, pig, rabbit, and chicken. These kind of animals has also anti beta glucan antibody. So, if they have they take agarics, it's considering to improve their immunity. It might work, but we we, we do not uh, try this data about efficacy. On um, competitive environment in Japan, uh, yeah, at the veterinary, uh, other actually other agaric products, maybe competitor is agaric products, but other agaric products doesn't have strong evidence like our king agaric. So the evidence is totally different. And also many uh, agaric product is uh, indoor one, and also some are extracted. And about the extracted, uh, we have some data. Uh, this one is dried mushroom. Uh, we extra we try to extract by hot water. We extract only thirty four, only one third, about uh, like thirty percent. And also chemical, we do chemical process to extract the uh, the beta glucan. Uh, we extract only fifty percent. Other fifty percent is still in the mushroom. So, if we extra, if we try to extract the beta glucan uh, from the mushroom, just um, the effect is uh, weaker. So that's why we do not do any extract. We use uh, this um, dried mushroom one hundred percent without any extracted. So that's all. So 